why all these shoes have been looking for me? Because I'm Sandeep Gajakas. I'm the only one who can take them out of their misery. I own the shoe laundry. The service is very simple. You wear shoes, they get dirty, we wash it. OCD. OCD. Obsessive Compulsive Disorder. Obsessive Compulsive Disorder. One of my nicknames in college given to me by my friends, you know. I was always finicky about dust and cleaning things. It led to an idea and I'm glad I've been able to materialize it. And uh, just from being the one who is finicky about dirt and finicky about hygiene, I have become somebody who has really thought of something different and started a service that was not on the market and is doing it well. So I think uh, obsessive compulsive disorder as such has really worked out in a good way for me. Every time I said, nah, yeah, it's too crazy, it's too crazy, it kept coming back to me and saying, boss, it is really viable. Every time I was, in, I was walking or sitting and chilling out with friends, or anywhere for that matter, and I saw another person walk by with a dirty pair of shoes, I used to say 100 bucks. This was my workshop. Nobody is really allowed to come here except my workers. Even friends are out of bound. My music is on, my work is on. Most of the time, they're woken up by a phone call from a client. Either because he's going to ask me what time his shoes are getting delivered, or a client who is saying that they want their shoes picked up. I owe a lot to my customers. We all grow up telling ourselves, I want to do something different, I want to do something different. And none of us really go ahead and do something different. We all, at us, as soon as we get out of school and enter college, and by the time you realize that we're going to have to make a livelihood, we all get sucked into the same old rat race, and we all just dissipate into the system. Everybody goes into the same old kind of jobs. And I myself got sucked into it. And I disappeared somewhere. And I really wanted to break free and emerge out of that whole thing and stand alone. Give yourself one year to explore, to do something that you want to do. To spend time in pursuing something that you probably even didn't know you could do. All said and done. One year is not asking too much to do justice to your life. Clean, spick and span, tidy, sterile, dust-free, neat, sparkling, spotless.